Full optimism um, kind of goes toward an anarchist model, uh, which is also, I think, a queer life world model of reinventing the world, which is to say you can reinvent the world from the relations on the ground. Uh, and not just assume that you have to down a structure, but that structures are expressed in our bodies and in our social relations, and that we can start to actually change the ways our social relations are become structure um, by trusting the ways in which we can build things. And we call these queer counterpublics, Michael Warner did, and or, you know, I talked about heteronormativity, um, and then we were producing work that was trying to think about how normativity finds different kinds of creativity and objects and that we can actually use its sponginess to make better worlds. And I think like this festival is an outcome of that kind of thinking, now 20 years old, um, uh, to try to give us material to think with for remaking social life, not just like taking down social life, but actually remaking it because people can't just live in the negative. They have to be living by changing the way objects can work. pandemic crisis especially, people are really rethinking the question of do you have to earn your life or can the state actually make available its hoarded wealth to enable people to live without earning but just because they're alive. I think these are really crucial moments in the history of capitalism and whenever neoliberalism or whenever capitalism goes through a crisis, those are the opportunities we have to try to, to make something that was on the radical thought or kind of a, a thought whispered between people into common sense. And I think that's one of the things about crisis ordinariness is a crisis is not an exception. This is one of the main arguments of the book. Crisis is not an exception, it's embedded in life. And so when we think about the, pre the present moment in which we both have pandemic uh, shattering of, of notions of productivity, but also the rise of authoritarianisms all over the world as a way of kind of hoping that some figure of power could make everything orderly, that orderly would be the same thing as security, even though we know that that form of order, authoritarian order, is about the destruction of life and a decision about who gets to be in and who gets to be out, which is to say it's liberalism admitting that liberalism was always a form of authoritarianism, just a soft authoritarianism rather than hard. Body count. Remain visible, exposed. My eyes are open. You got a problem for addressing.
Yeah, 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 yeah. 